Sorry ha, kung ganun rin lang. Bakit ho pa kayo nakapwesto sa gobyerno? Sayang po yung pinapasweldo sa inyo ng ating gobyerno na mga simpleng katanungan in behalf of Taong Bayan, I'm here because I was elected by the people to ask questions like this. It is my job. I was voted for this. I represent the people of the Philippines. And that's why I'm asking you this question. Nakatanungan din po ng Taong Bayan at hindi nyo kayang sagutin. Magsiresign na kayo. I do also apologize because I was not... You apologize again. The... So, dalawa ng punch pilato natin. Sorry, sir. <coughs> Sasakit ang ulo ko dito. Walang makakasagot? Okay. Maganda ang paghugas kamay po ninyo. Hindi, hindi naman po, sir. It's just that... Uh, uh, Pero alam niyo po na magkakaroon tayo ng consultative meeting at uh, ito po ay patungkol doon sa dokumentong icing in the cake. Yes, sir. Pinakamadali, walk in the park actually itong sagot na ito. Yes, sir. Was... Ako kaya kong sagutin to. Kahit na hindi ako ang dapat sumasagot. However, sa umpisa pa lamang, hirap hmm. na kayo. Paano pa kaya mamaya sa mga susunod? Baka pagpapawisan na kayo, sinlaki ng buti ng munggo. To smuggling and tax evasion. Moreover, the fuel marking itself and the fuel inspection being conducted by the BOC and the BIR must be reliable and trustworthy. I repeat, must be reliable and trustworthy. And that is the reason why I call for this consultative meeting. We want to find out the status of the implementation of the fuel marking program. Ang dami natin kung pa alamin natin kung paano nga ba isinasagawa ang mga field inspection at kung bakit kumalas, kumalas di umano ang BIR sa field inspection. Kung, mga, kung nakakasuan nga ba ang mga nahuli sa field testing at kung mapagkakatiwalaan talaga ang isinasagawang fuel marking. Now, during the last hearing, hiniling ko po sa BOC na mag-submit po ng report sa atin para malaman ko po kung talagang ginagawa ng maayos ang fuel marking at field testing. And I received some documents from the BOC and I really appreciate that sending me these documents. Now, I have some few questions. Um, Pisang po natin sa timeline. October 31, 2018, notice to proceed, issued to SGS. Tama po. September 4, 2019, fuel marking program officially commenced. My first question is, bakit 11 months po from the time na nagkaroon po ng notice to proceed ang SGS para dun sa kontranta, sa fuel marking and testing, 11 months bago po nag-commence. Sino pong pwede sumagot? Is there anybody? Any volunteer? Bakit po 11 months? Gentlemen, ladies? G SGS? Meron ba tayong representative ng SGS dito? Do we have a representative from SGS? Wala? Para mahihain nata kayo ngayon lahat ngayon ha. Tuloy ako, nahihiya din sa inyo. So, wala mga kasagot. DOF. Sige, Department of Finance. Si Director Sheila Castelloni. Ma'am. Bakit po 11 months? From the time na na-issue na, na po yung notice to proceed, 11 months bago po nag-umpisa yung fuel marking. Sir, um, I would like to apologize if I cannot answer that particular question. You cannot? Yes, sir. Sino po sa tingin ninyo ang pwede makasagot po nito? Uh, sir, the previous uh, uh, representatives of the DOF, that's, uh, that, that is uh, Yusek Chonko. Nasaan po si Yusek Chonko? Uh, resigned po kasi siya. Nag-resign na? Yes, sir. Okay. 
maganda ang paghugas kamay po ninyo. Hindi, hindi naman po, sir. It's just that... Uh, uh, Pero alam niyo po na magkakaroon tayo ng consultative meeting at uh, ito po ay patungkol doon sa dokumentong isinumiti niyo po sa Bureau of Customs na ang Bureau of Customs naman isinumiti sa akin. So ngayon, sinasabi niyo po, hindi niyo masasagot ang unang napakadali kong tanong. That's just icing in the cake. Yes, sir. Pinakamadali. Walk in the park, actually, itong sagot na ito. Yes, sir. Was... Ako kaya kong sagutin to. Kahit na hindi ako ang dapat sumasagot. However, sa umpisa pa lamang, hirap hmm. na kayo. Paano pa kaya mamaya sa masusunod? Baka pagpapawisan na kayo, sinlaki ng buti ng munggo. Uh, sir, I'm really sorry because I was not involved uh, initially uh, with the fuel marking program and uh, I was only given the history without uh, okay. without the background. Hindi ba natin inibitahan yung SGS dito? Mga legis ko? Okay, nobody from SGS. Bureau of Customs, please. Anybody from the Bureau of Customs would like? Yes, sir. Good morning, sir. Okay. Special Agent. Bakit wala ko si uh, Commissioner? Special Agent 2? Uh -huh. Sorry, hindi ko sa, sa minamata po, minamalate yung inyong posisyon. Pero dapat, di ba, ang, uh, ang kaharap ko dapat dito, at least man lang, Deputy Commissioner? Yes, sir. Uh, actually, the Chairman, uh, Attorney Teddy Raval. The... Or, or anybody in the Bureau yes, of Customs na nagkipag-deal, nagkipag-transact sa SDS, sumasama yes, sa field testing, o yung team leader man lang, are you a part of that team yes, sa uh, pag, uh, nagsasagawa ng uh, field testing? Uh, more or less, sir, data management, sir. No, data management. program Under the Project Implementation Office. Under the what, sir? Project Implementation Office of the Field Marketing Project Project Implementation Office. So kasama dyan sir. po yung uh, field testing? Uh, sa field deployment lang po ng personal. Sa what? Field deployment, uh, field deployment lang po. Field deployment. Okay. Sure. Well, since wala na akong choice, that's good enough for me. Sige po, pwede niyo sagutin yung tanong ko. Yung pinakamadaling tanong sa lahat. Bakit po it took 11 months uh, uh, from the time na nag-issue na po ng notice to proceed? Uh, okay. SGS at SIGPA. Uh, sir. Uh, and uh, then uh, 11 months. Nag-umpisa yung fuel marking, sir. I do also apologize because I was not... You apologize the, again. The... So, dalawa ng punsyo pilato natin. Sorry, sir. Oh. <coughs> Sasakit ang ulo ko dito. Walang makakasagot. Wala. Napakadaling sa katanungan. And then, pangalawang tanong. So, 2019, September 4, 2019, nag-umpisa yung fuel marking. February 23, 2021, nag-umpisa ang field testing. September 2019, almost two years, saka po nag-umpisa ang field testing. Walang magsasagot na naman, I'm sure. Ako, alam ko yung sagot, isasagot nyo na. Sasabihin nyo, COVID, right? Hindi ko na kayo ng kasagutan. Ako na sumasagot ng katanong. Tanong ko, sagot ko. Ano ba to? 